Good morning, everybody. It is Thursday, April 30th, 2020. It's really hard to believe that it's the last day of April and that tomorrow will be May. Um, time is really flying. Uh, I don't know about you, but the rain this morning has me off to kind of a slow start. Um, I think we're going to have a couple of days of rain, so kind of nice days to curl up with a good book. Uh, speaking of reading, Mrs. Hall um, made a video for us for our last lesson on uh, theme and um, author's message. So that is up there. And um, she uses a book. She uses um, a fancy Nancy book and um, really models how you can determine what the author's message is and what the theme is of a book. So I hope you enjoy that. And then you're going to do the same work with Library Lion. Uh, I love Library Lion, and I actually just got the sequel to that book. Uh, once you guys read that one today, maybe I'll do a read aloud of the sequel because it's it's one of my favorites right now. Uh, math is posted. Mrs. Maturo found a really fun, <laughs> I think it's really fun, <laughs> a really fun song um, that talks about lines, parallel lines, um, perpendicular lines, and intersecting lines. It's kind of catchy. Uh, maybe do a dance break if you're looking for some movement uh, today. And, and then I posted a problem set. And uh, the regular, <laughs> you might hear Laura talking in the background, uh, and uh, the regular video from Embark. There's um, a Newzella article on uh, being an archaeologist. Uh, so that's a really cool job. And then um, there is a, a science assignment on there for you as well. So enjoy everything. I will come on with uh, a reading of Poppy and Rye. The, the chapter that we have today is really long, um, so I might do it in two parts. But I hope everybody's well and um, enjoy this uh, last day of April, even though we've got a lot of April showers today. All right, see you later.